Well, it's great to be here at Bullaburra this morning uh, in the heart of the Riverland dryland farming country. The, these guys are innovators and uh, they are an example of just how important uh, the launch of the blueprint, uh, the South Australian grains industry blueprint will be to the industry. Uh, the consultation uh, process is now open, so I urge all of the grain growers to get out there, get online and have your say, uh, to be a part of the 2030 vision. That, that vision uh, is to increase this, uh, this industry to $6 billion. Uh, and the government are backing them as a 3% growth agenda uh, as they're part of the industry. So Adrian, tell us about it. We're really keen on the 3% growth agenda. We think we can achieve it. Um, we're excited by the different pillars we've set up. We hope people get engaged in each pillar. Um, after being through the process of setting up the pillars, we've found some, certainly some gaps in our industry that we're keen to address. Um, the pillar I was particularly interested in was the um, education format. So. We'd like to see all generations get involved in this. We've got students looking to go into the, into the next phase of agriculture or begin agriculture. We've got some going through that process. Um, we've got some who have been through the process. We'd like all those age groups now to get engaged and tell us where the gaps in, in that pillar in particular will fit into the future of growing the grains industry, which we think we can achieve. Yeah, and Tanya, it's a really exciting time for the grains industry. Tell us about your uh, the blueprint. Uh, yeah, well, I've been um, really interested in the innovation pillar in particular, and I know that uh, farmers are always looking for new and innovative ways of doing things better. We've got some really great innovative farmers in South Australia, and uh, that's just one of the pillars, and I just really encourage people to have a read through, make sure they're happy with the blueprint, that it reflects their thoughts and their, and their wants for the future. And um, yeah, give us your feedback, really keen to hear from people.